Hey guys, Brad Scott here with BradScottVisuals.com and I took out my GoPro Hero 3 Black Edition um, right after sunset here in Maui uh, to test out low light uh, underwater. And so I'm going to show you what the pictures turned out like. Um, I was using burst mode to capture uh, the movements. My buddy was doing little zen moves here. Um, so I'm going to show you how to clean them up a little bit. I'm in uh, Adobe Bridge and I'm going to open this up in Photoshop in Camera Raw. So I just right clicked on the photo and then click Open in Camera Raw. And as you can tell, it actually did quite a good job capturing this image. Um, the water was pretty clear. Uh, and now we just have to clean it up a little bit, add a tiny bit of contrast. So the, the lens on the GoPro Hero 3 Black Edition is a uh, f2.8 for the aperture and this shot was at a 60th of a second at ISO 366 um, so it captured it pretty well uh, the shutter speed has slowed down since the low light kicked in and it looks like the aperture bumped up a little bit it's usually around 100 for the ISO um, so let's tweak this a little bit and show you what you can get out of this so normally I like to start with the contrast whenever I'm doing underwater images and just kind of bump the contrast up a little bit there. Alright, and you can go either way with this image. You could either turn it into a silhouette um, and really kind of bump the shadows down or you could get kind of like an HDR looking image uh, putting the shadows up and then the highlights down. Um, and then up in the clarity like that but I think I'm gonna prefer the silhouette look so I'm gonna leave the shadows alone bump those highlights back up a little bit and then I'm actually going to reduce the black and then up the clarity a little bit more so that's kind of a nice silhouette image pretty cool looking and uh, then I'm just going to go ahead and save this image. Um, you'll be meditating underwater. And save that as uh, maximum quality at 12 as a JPEG. Hit save. And I'm ready to go. And the the GoPro should print pretty clear at up to around um, 20 by 30. You could probably push it up to about 30 by 40 on certain prints uh, if there's enough light in them. If you want to do anything extra with this image, if we look in closely at 100%, you can tell that there's a little bit of noise, not too bad, but all you have to do is just open this little triangle tab sharpening and noise reduction and you can completely get rid of the noise there and you up that luminescent contrast and then let's see how that looks perfect so you could resave that again like that hope you like that guys please remember to comment rate and subscribe with any questions and we'll see you next time and go check out any of my other videos um, and check out all my photos at bradscottvisuals.com or islandbeachart.com. Thanks again.